Hi everybody, we're in Canton, Connecticut, also known as Collinsville. This is the Collinsville Axe Company. Um, and you can see the axe heads and the different knives. It had a big flood in 1955 that pretty much put it out of business. Um, and it goes way back this place. There's, some of these photos are from 1901. And it's just really old. And it's a really cool building. Now it's an antique place. And we're here because the Farmington River, you can see right here, runs through it. And it's just, now it's become a sort of scenic place. And there's antiques and stuff like that. It's, it's a cool little village to visit. If you haven't been here, um, it's, it's nice. A bunch of little restaurants you can walk around. They have a farmer's market. If you like any kind of um, watercraft or fishing or any of that kind of stuff, this is the place to be. This is really, really good swimming. I mean, you got it all here, right? Uh, excellent trout fishing. So let's, let's take a little walk. So we're on, um, <clears throat> this is all part of the Axe Factory. It was really extensive. And um, the company's still around. I, I understand they're in Mexico, so they're still making stuff. But we're on this old railroad bridge, and now it's converted for, you know, um, hiking and walking and stuff like that. I think it can even take bikes on it, but we'll get over the river. It, it spans the, the river, so we'll get over there and check it out. In case you're wondering people out there um, it's cold it's, it's real cold <laughs> I think that sign says do not jump off the bridge um, originally no jumping from bridge allowed well that doesn't stop the kids that are always doing it all summer long every time I come here. I mean, you look at this bridge here. They just don't make them like that anymore. Have a nice day. So here's the river. There's some big trout in there. And this is uh, this this river is famous for trout fishing. Absolutely, some monster trout in here. So that's it. We love you out there. Remember, it's about getting out there and getting water on your head from the bridge. We're going to wrap it up and find something hot to drink and go heat up because it's cold. It's cold, but it's beautiful. Uh, we're definitely just on location having fun today. And uh, we just want you to know that we appreciate you. We love everything. I love it. Especially, you know, you call me crazy. I, listen, I know what we're doing is crazy. You're chasing the imaginary. That's by nature just a crazy thing to do. But keep it up, you know. Get creative. Well, I probably shouldn't encourage that. <laughs> we love you out there. I gotta grab my dog. We, we really like um, interaction. So, you know, all kidding aside, um, we love when you tell us about your adventures, what's going on in your in neck of the woods, and if you have some places for us to check out, we will definitely do that. He's real scary, this guy. He <laughs> might love you for that. Hi. So as you can see, a lot of people use this. It's, it's freezing cold. 
It's not stopping anybody. This wonderful lady was telling me about her 12-year-old chihuahua. He's not doing good. Starling nest right there. it up. So come on down here, check out the Farmington River. It's totally free. You can rent tubes and kayaks and stuff if you find the right place. And um, just even if you just go have a picnic, I mean, it's, it's a beautiful, beautiful river. Arguably, Arguably the most beautiful river in Connecticut. Now I know I'm gonna hear from some people saying no, 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 the Connecticut River or Willimantic. Willimantic's a nice river, um, but for my money, for swimming and fishing and just hanging out, it's the Farmington River all day long. Oh, it's cold. Can you like there? If you're gonna make comments, tell me if you can like feel the cold just from the video. Man. And I am not prepared for that today. I wasn't, wasn't getting ready to go on location, but that's what happens as soon as you hop in the car on a day off. And the reason you haven't seen more videos is because I don't, I don't have as much time off anymore. But it's a real nice day. Overcast, just the way I like it. That's real New England. Let's say back home in Maine, foggy. Yeah, got some fog coming in. <laughs> it's how it looks. If you're not from New England, this is how it looks all year round. It's cold and foggy, and gray. I mean, 50% of the time. And in the summer, on your weekends, it's gonna rain for sure. And then during the week, it's gonna be nice. <laughs> That's very true, people. You plan your vacations to New England accordingly. Come on a Wednesday, you know. That'll be uh, guaranteed to be nice. Come on. Okay. You got a lot of flair. That one there. There's a lot of artist studios here, as you could imagine. All kinds of, it's really cool. On Friday nights here at one of the markets, they have an open mic in one of the nicest farm markets in Connecticut when that's going in season. All right, everybody. Okay, let's get this beautiful dog in here. And we love you, and we're definitely, definitely wrapping it up. So it's about getting out there, which we did, and when you get out there, <laughs> dress appropriately. All right, we love you.